I always start my vlogs right here in front of our iconic tower and I often think maybe I should go in you know oh hello there good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you are in YouTube world well where's Jamie's rock and soul going today I'll show you we're going up there my good friend all the way from Dan Sa travel with Taz has invited me for a tower tour and afternoon tea but we need to be over there let's go I can see your towers in the distance we have to go on the green bench to sit on the tower okay Oh, right, okay. The first attraction we come to. Uh, Hello, everyone, welcome to the Blackpool Towers 4 D Center experience. Very quickly before we start the show, we'll contain strobe lights and flash imagery. Now, if you're affected by this and need to leave the room at any time, you can do so by heading through to the back of the cinema and then click by the alternative doors on your Founder. Way. You want to stand there, get the effects right in the middle. <laughs> an immersive experience viewers you get to put the 3d glasses on you get wet you feel the wind you see the seagulls flying around the tower I'm gonna fly by the Isle of Man now lock and load viewers Taz it's time for a history lesson my love there you go that's the year I was born Oh yes, oh yes, I have an assistant today. And it leads you. It's all this old steel work up here, look. It's old arch. Look at that handsome devil. Without whom, we wouldn't even have Blackpool Tower. But he hands like shovels, look. We're waiting for the elevator, which takes less than a minute. Stuck in a lift, viewers, with three women and a bloke. <laughs> <laughs> Going up Taz. If you look to the left there viewers, the one with the window open behind the football stadium, that's my house. Could I ask a question, lovely escalator lady? Does this job have its ups and downs? Really ups, it's very good. <laughs> Live with Travel with Taz and Jamie's Rock of Soul. We're up in the air just because we wanted to get a better view of the comedy carpet lot. And look at the view. Now, you may or may not know there is a, uh, a glass bottom to the tower that Jamie's not stood on yet because. I've got a brain. But Taz, she's up for it. Taz, have you got any family members you want to say goodbye to? Okay. <laughs> and if you can see where Taz is walking, look, it's a glass bottom. See so right down there. Go on. You're going to jump on it. the river dance with me. <laughs> Maybe the pattern is Taz. Pick it up Taz. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Highest bar in the UK viewers look. Bar 380 I'm guessing. Because it's 380 feet in the air bro. Ask a stupid question Jamie's rock or so. We're heading further up now up these old stairs. We're going outside. Ooh, it's a bit breezy Taz. Up to you. I look at the face, up, up the Going up. We're well over 400 feet up in the air now. The air's starting to get thinner. We may need an oxygen mask, but that may be just because I'm 51. <laughs> Here we go, even higher up. 
So here we are, we've lost Taz somewhere. A bit difficult because she can't get past me. Oh, here she is, admiring the beautiful views of my hometown of Blackpool and beyond. So this way is going uh, south and west and north with slight showers, a slight chance of cloud and Taz is looking eastwards. Have you seen anything interesting, love? Yeah, I see the lovely winter gardens. Oh yes, winter gardens down there. Chandeliers. You can see the, uh, I'm looking further afield, look, look at that. Yeah, Pendle Hill over there. Oh wow, yeah, I was there not long ago. Didn't see any witches though. No. We've had a lovely little uh, view here, Taz, haven't we? Of, here we have. Of amazing Lancashire. This is the top of the tower. This is as far as you can go. You might as well tell people about your channel while we're here, Taz, for my viewers. Yeah, my channel is Travel with Taz, and basically it's to do with point of view travel and budget hotels and all sorts of little things like that it's like so why not why not subscribe or even just take a why look. not indeed or just take a look i was gonna go to work today but i got high da -da. We are packed in to the uh, lift like we're coming over from France and a dinghy at the moment. <laughs> Viewers, here's something you need to be aware of. And Jamie's Rock and Soul is not happy about this. You cannot pay cash in the tower. Cash is king, not here. Remember that. It's a great venue, brilliant, but you can't spend no money. Ladies and gentlemen, the award for most entertaining travel channel in Swindon. It's travel with Taz! You're down with your kiddies, look, Taz. They've got a VR experience here, my love. Yeah. Uh, and you can spend cash in these areas. You get a Sonic there. There's another arcade. Look, down on. How many feet up are we now, Taz? About 50? Yeah. We're not very high anymore, guys. This little tour we're doing with Taz, this is. Um, tower an afternoon tea today but it is important i know we had a bit of fun earlier about the cash situation yeah, didn't we, eh? but... you do need to have digital currency and the only way we can stop that that's for another vlog as you come out of the arcade area you, you come over to dinosaur mini golf uh, taz is five years running number one get on that number one spot it's all right i'm always the bridesmaid I'm on number two. It's been here 100 odd years. I come here and I break Blackpool Tower. Look, let's put it back. Look at this. Shame, look. Yeah. It needs a bit of TLC, all of it, doesn't it? Yeah. I know, it's a shame because do you think how many years old this is? But you won't get the stuff like this these days. Maybe on a car boot if you're lucky. So I thought I'd, uh, I bought a little 499 build your own tower kit, viewers. And this is how it turned out, in all seriousness. Look at that. That would cost 120 quid to make. Hey, not too shabby. Seven levels, viewers. Uh, we're on level three at the moment. Some more historic memorabilia. I said that correctly for a change. So some of the old stars lot that used to come here. Oh, we're advertising fags. Can't pay in cash in the advertised fags. What's going on? It's got an international feel all the way over from Belfast. Did I say that correctly? We've got some people from Belfast. Uh, would you like to wave hello to the channel? Hello. Lovely to meet you enjoying the tower. Yes, good, good. We're just uh, waiting for the uh, ballroom. We're going to have afternoon tea at 2 p.m. But Taz is leading me astray here, yeah, viewers. She's a bad influence on me, you know. I'm not going to lie to you. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the circus. I'm only joking. Ta-da! Ta-da! How much water does the circus ring hold? Have a guess, quick. Three, two, one. There you go, viewers. What do you think? Where's the answer? Oh, you're having a laugh. We have to find the answer. What do you think? It says 
if you like me and Taz like a bit of ballroom dancing, you know, I'm partial to the old Passe Doble or a Viennese Foxtrot or a Waltz. I've not a clue what I've just said, but here you go. Uh, you can actually come save these dates in your calendar. Forget about that one. Forget about that one. That's the one. 21st of September. Ballroom nights. What a night out that'd be, eh? Now, to the naked eye, you can just see an absolutely handsome YouTuber. But uh, Tower World, you know, look, was opened by member Diana. God bless her soul. She opened this in 1992. Picture the scene. It's 1899. We just have the Wurlitzer are installed. Can you hear the music, viewers? Has is entertaining her viewers look. <laughs> Chivalry is not dead. <laughs> I hold the door open for you. There you go, madame. Yeah, yeah. It'll be over in a flash with Jamie and Taz having afternoon tea. For a princely sum of three hundred and thirty pound thirty-three p. So here we are, viewers, for afternoon tea. We do have a little bombshell to drop. We was actually married this morning. We weren't really, <laughs> but we are having some. Well, you never know. Rumours on YouTube. You never know. It must be true if it's on YouTube. <laughs> Music. Dance. Taz. Me. T. So imagine the scene. It's now 1907. You've brought your good lady to the Tower Ballroom for her afternoon tea. Could I get your jacket, madame? Oh, sorry, nearly choked you. I'm trying to be a gentleman. There you go, my love. There is your seat. And we're going to purvey the surroundings. I'm going to ask him if he knows any Jason Derulo after this track. This is Mr. Phil Kelsall, who has been an organist here at Blackpool Tower since 1975, viewers. And isn't he brilliant? I think we've got some professional dancers as well, though. Let's have a cup of coffee. In little posh cups. Now I always check on me. I always check to see if the spoon's gone. Oh look how shiny they are. <laughs> and there's the lovely lady with our butties as we call them back in Nottingham. Here we are afternoon tea with our posh china teapot coffee pot. Here is afternoon tea. We've got some gorgeous cakes. We've got some scones and clotted cream and preserve. And we've got some butties as well. Sugar lumps, coffee, it don't get no better. And Taz. Oh, hello. Have I seen you somewhere before? Tell her. Bravo. Bravo. The coffee okay for you, madame? A little bit strong, but that's the problem. This is a bit better than the napkins you get in your local takeaway. Look at this, viewers. Oh, hello. I need a new tea towel at home. Where's your bag? Let's go with the tuna. 
first thing I've noticed, lovely soft bread. Yeah. Ooh, look at them misses. Let's go a little on the tuna. Please tell me it's not tuna flakes. Okay. Is it in mayonnaise? Growing up, personally, I'd not seen this till I got to Blackpool. back in Nottingham as a kid. You'll know this. We put vinegar in our tuna. It's that vinegar in it. Oh, it's a game changer. Next up, we got cheese and pickle. How's that? Bread's a little bit dry, if we're being honest. What about the cheese and pickle though? I bet the pickle's fresh. The pickle's not too bad. But it's definitely not Branston's. Not Branston? I don't think it's Branston. How dare you, Mr. Kelso? <laughs> cheese and pickle on dry bread. Not bad. I'm an onion taz and lettuce salad, whatever. Yeah. You see the size of Jamie's Rock and Soul. I could eat about 200 of these. Just keep watching. Where's he going? for a keyboard player, around about 60 odd years old, grey hair, disappeared into the ground, he's not been seen since. Taz? I think they've put something in this coffee mate. Scones. I want to do the clotted cream and jam challenge. Cornwall or Devon? Jam, cream, cream, jam. Which one first? Here we go with a barn dance. Wonderful afternoon of joy. Thank you so much, Taz. Really appreciate that, darling. How it used to be, and how it still can be. Just a little bit of positivity. Life's for living, folks. Look, all the, look how happy all these people are, just partaking in music. You know the message I'm sending, it's loud and clear. for the egg. I don't want no egg. But here we go. Yes, it's got crest in it. Bottoms up. Be enjoying that. <laughs> Quite creamy. Nice. Yeah. Coming from Swindon, 
I can give you some wisdom about scones. So this one, cream, uh, jam and clotted cream is the Devon way of doing it. And cream and then the jam is the Cornwall way of doing it. I wonder which one tastes better, haha. <laughs> How lovely of Taz why she's gone to the toilet, I'll tell you. She invited me on this experience. Here at the tower in my hometown, enjoyed it really much. And apart from the, the small dilemma of not being able to spend cash, it's been really enjoyable. Kudos. Make sure you check the channel out. Travel with Taz. Here live. Tower Bulls. Strictly come brownies. tea is nearly over, Taz. Taz is just finishing with the cheesecake, not Cornish, not Devon, Blackpool style, Iceland, 4 99 16 portions. How does it taste? Nice and sweet. Give afternoon tea a mark out of Dies, sorry, that's French. A mark out of Z, sorry, that's German. Mark out of Z. So uh, I think we'll go over to Taz first and see how she rates this beautiful afternoon tea in this historic, iconic ballroom. Taz, the overall experience with the staff, Mr. Gaskell up there, the professional dancers and the showing off dancers, but the food, out of 10, what do you think? Thank you very much, Taz. Well, the ambience, the beautiful staff, the wonderful dancers, the lovely sandwiches, me talking in a posh accent when I'm from council estate. It can only be a 10 out of 10, without a doubt. And uh, 11 out of 10, because I'm with my mucker Taz as well. We got a little doggy bag to take our delicious cakes home. Thanks to Taz. I was paid for this experience, thank you so much. We've come up here, viewers, because we just wanted to show you a um, bird's eye view of the ballroom. It's been a great afternoon, and we met another YouTuber, which I'm going to put on the screen. It's a lady who works here, she's moving back to Brighton, and she's called Tiger Moth Resin. It's an art channel, folks. What's the other guy named, what, what's that posh guy name who used to do that in the wall thing? I don't know. No, Leighton Williams. I've actually got a photograph of him. Oh. No, I was going to say, yeah. <laughs> so, travel with Taz. Jamie's rock and soul. That has been Blackpool Tower. Been up the tower. We've had a lovely afternoon tea. We've seen the world. It's her organ. We've had lovely scrumptious 10 out of 10 food. 
we've done the whole lot so here's the easy bit now down there for both of us and hit the notification bell and we'll join you mid tabs maybe on the next one so until the next time love you love you